Hello, hello, this is Stella Rose. I'm recording again. It's Friday. Um, it's been a long week. It's my first week at home in a long, long time. So it's been a lot of paying bills and getting used to being around the dogs and just, just you know, just stuff. So anyways, um, oh, I'm going to put some music on. I like to put music in the background when I do these things. So. so I'm Donna, this is the seventh video blog, and when my sister's coming over soon, we're going out to, um, to dinner together. Um, we don't do that enough, you know, sister stuff. My sister and I are close. We've never been closer than, than we are now, so it's, it's nice that we have time to do these kinds of things. I think it's really important to make time do these kinds of things. So, um, next week is Mother's Day. Next weekend is Mother's Day weekend. And I've made arrangements to go and spend it with my mom. Um, she lives in Dallas and outside of Dallas. It's all big one, big metroplex. If you, li if you live nearby, you know what I mean. But, um, I drove out there last year from Phoenix with my puppy, who at the time was fit in the front seat. It's a small little thing, but not anymore. She's big now. Um, but Mother's Day is a big deal to me. Um, it never was when I grew up, or Father's Day either, really. You know, it was okay, buy a car, get a gift of some kind. And, and it surprised me how hard it hit me the first Father's Day after my father passed away. And so ever since then, I've spent time really appreciating um, Mother's Day while I can. So anyways, I'm going to go see Mom next weekend, um, and I'm looking forward to that. Even though it's only a couple days, it's a lot of traveling, a lot of distance for a couple of days. but. If I don't, there'll be regrets. And key issue in my world, no regrets. Um, I'm at a very interesting transition point in life. Um, that's not to say it has anything to do with Donna or transition in the sense that transgender people sometimes use it. It's, transitions, I think, happen constantly. Um, they should happen constantly. Let's put it that way. Changing from one thing to another. It seems like so many people spend so much energy trying to stop it, trying to keep things the same. You know, they find a place of comfort. And they want to hold on to it. You know, they want to keep it for as long as they can. And so they spend so much energy just trying to keep things from changing. But Things are changing for me. Um, it's really one of those times of life where I'm, uh, I'm really happy and I'm really looking for new beginnings. I'm looking for all kinds of, of things. And so it's very much a transitional period for me. It's scary a little, but that's okay. I've been scared before and it's, not, it's a friend at this point. We coexist. That's the way it is. Anyways, my sister will be here in a little while and I don't have too much to say um, other than I'm glad it's Friday. It's been a big week. Um, now I'm looking forward to the weekend. So, we'll keep this short, we'll keep it crisp. Um, this is windblown hair, Donna. I'm supposed to have a hair appointment next week, but I don't know if it'll be here to go and try and the best we can. Grow it out a little bit. You know, my hair is my best friend and worst enemy sometimes. I don't know, but we'll just, just make a do with it. I weighed myself. See, in the past I've said that uh, scale, not my friend. That's true. But I was at the gym, weighed myself, and the good news is that I weigh about as much now as I did when I transitioned 10 years ago, the other transition, 
you know, that transition. So that's actually really good. Um, I have this problem that when I lose weight, so that my body is the way I like it, my face gets too skinny. And when I have a healthy chubby face, not so healthy chubby body. So anyways, it's, it's one of those constant battles. But ever since I started estrogen, it's harder to lose weight. It is. Women have it harder. I know they do. But that's OK. Tomorrow, I will go for a long run outside. Um, it's supposed to be nice. And um, I don't know how many more days I've got here. Um, so we'll just enjoy each one as it comes. I think in the morning we'll go to uh, Mendon Ponds Park and uh, in the afternoon I'll go for a nice long run, just me and my thoughts and, um, and my tunes. So, okay, that's enough babbling. You have a great weekend and we'll talk to you next time. This is Donna Rose, signing off.